Hey YouTube, Sam here. Well YouTube, somewhere in the middle here, I have lost some footage of this video that I've been doing of the two year, uh, what do I think of the Harbor Freight Shed. But uh, I've went ahead and put it together, the parts that i found, and some new stuff that I've uh, done. So hopefully you enjoy this, it's probably closer to two and a half year, uh, maybe even three by now. So uh, hopefully Second you enjoy. Second winter, as you can see there's snow on the ground. And you can see there's quite a bit of wind going right now. Uh, and this has actually calmed down from where it was earlier. Um, so even though I thought I had it in a pretty good spot for wind, it actually seems to blow through here quite often. And it's still holding up. Um, I do have a couple things I'll show you here in a minute. As you can see, we had a pretty really bad storm. I actually knocked our cable line down. All the branches came out of the trees. I didn't show you that. And I don't know if you'll be able to hear me through the wind once again. You can hear the wind rattling against the tip there. But as you can see, it was bad enough uh, storms to knock down all these branches out of the tree, busted that branch clear out, destroyed my top of my shed. So keep an eye out for a video trying to fix that. And we'll see if I can. Um, but anyhow, she's still, for the most part, holding up after a couple years of pretty harsh winters and also pretty harsh summers well since that last footage uh, summer has got come and is starting on its way out it's September of this year so it's been probably three or four months hey Andy probably been three or four months since uh, I did that video but I lost some footage but I got this all cleaned out as far as my shed is concerned, I just pushed it up with a 2x4 and kind of knocked it around until I was okayly happy with it for now. So that's probably the way it'll stay, at least through this winter and the next summer anyway. But the whole point of this video is a review on this over here, the uh, Harbor Freight Shed and, and how it's holding up after a couple years. And like I said, it's it was a couple years at that time through a couple of summers and winters or at least at least two winters and one summer something like that and now it's held up through another summer which we had record heat and uh, boy both my dogs want to be a part of this one so and let's go inside here we are inside the shed it's held up okay um, for what it is I'm very happy with how well it's held up actually um, only a few things like I don't hose it down or wash it so it's gotten pretty dirty and uh, hopefully you can hear through all this wind and as you might or might not be able to see right over here and I got a bee that's watching me now it's another thing this thing seems to attract bees anyway the light spots right there I'll get over here and that spot you can definitely see that so it's not like it's actually tearing it's more like it's separating from the the sun so it's not going to be waterproof anymore by any means um, it still you know keeps the sun and the snow and some of the rain off of things although it's not like it really matters if this stuff gets a little bit of stuff on it it's all to tear apart but some of it's stuff I'd rather not have a lot of moisture in while I'm tearing it apart anyhow it's held up for me pretty well I've been very happy with it for what I paid yet again you got to remember where it's from it's hard freight you don't pay a lot for it and for how much I've paid it's done in the job very well um, there will be another iteration of this I would definitely recommend doing this uh, deal with the uh, straps here for holding up a little bit more weight uh, I have a video on that you can go see it's nothing big but obviously uh, it works because I still have it here so anyhow I'm gonna call this a video uh, I know it wasn't a whole lot but I figured after a couple years plus I would uh, give you a little bit of an update on how mine's held up and it's really been through some hacks so um, this is Sam. Happy. All Jack right. Of all, Master Nun, you all have a good one.